guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Bridget and today I'm going to show you how to do a simple glamour skull makeup. Great one for a last minute Halloween makeup that you can throw together. As I've mentioned in the description, this is makeup only, meaning I am not about to tell you in the middle of this video to pull out any kind of latex, prosthetics, anything that you wouldn't just have lying around the house. So pretty much as long as you've got a basic makeup collection at home, you should be able to complete this makeup look. All right, let's jump into it. Okay, I'm jumping in first with my Morphe eyelid primer and I'm just gonna place this over my entire eyelids. Then I'm grabbing my So Iconic palette, also by Morphe, and I'm taking the classic color. I'm gonna apply this over my entire eyelids as well. And I'm jumping in with my Huda Beauty palette. This is the nude eyeshadow palette. I'm taking these two colors, which are Raw and Teddy. I'm applying the Teddy first, which is the lighter color, and applying that on the outer edge of the eye and just above the eyelid and blending that out nicely. Then I'm jumping in with the raw color and applying that over the top of the teddy and also applying that nice and high right up to the inner corner of my eyebrow. I'm making sure to blend this out really well. I'm grabbing my Plum Pleasers palette. I'm taking this black color and I'm applying this to the inner corner of my eyelid right up towards that eyebrow as well. Once I've applied the black first, I'm just blending it out slightly and making it into a nice angled shape. And and bringing it down my nose also slightly as well. Taking this light shimmery color from the same palette and applying that over the center of my eyelid. And then I'm taking this gorgeous cosmetics white starlet powder and applying that on the inner corner of my eyes as well as on the brow bone. I'm grabbing a black pencil eyeliner next and just applying that on the lower waterline. Then I'm grabbing my Model Rock lashes with my Duo Lash Glue. Guys, I honestly don't remember which style these were. I have lost the box since I filmed this. But just take any really pretty gorgeous pair of lashes and you'll be fine. Now I'm just taking that raw color again that I used on the top eyelid and I'm applying that underneath the lower lash line using a nice bullet smudgy brush. That's the technical term. Now I'm taking this white eyeliner called Coconut from Morphe. If you can't tell, I bloody love Morphe products. I'm using this one to do the outline for my skull bone on my cheek. And then I'm taking these two brownish colors from my Morphe palette again, and I'm just going over the top of those lines. I'm then smudging that out using a blending brush and once I've done that I'm going over the top of it with that black color I used on my eyelid as well and also blending that one out too. This is just a super basic way of creating a skull look and I will be going into far more detailed skull bone looks for this Halloween 2020 so keep an eye out on my channel. Now once I've done the cheek one I'm just going to add in some lines coming out of the inner corner of my eyebrows. This is going to give us a nice grumpy look which which is always great for a skull. I'm just then using my white eyeliner again to map out the shape of the nose bones. And then I'm going over that with a black eyeliner pen and filling it in with that one as well. Okay guys, now if you can just go ahead and grab some nose and scar wax and spirit gum. Nah, just kidding. No special effects today. Gotcha. I'm just jumping in next with a concealer that's a few shades lighter than my normal skin color and I'm applying that just over the lip area and blending that out with a beauty sponge. And then just jumping in with that black eyeshadow again and applying it on the inner section of the lips and just extending it out either side just to create the basis for where we're going to put down our skull teeth. Then I'm just taking the same black liquid eyeliner from before and creating some very basic vertical lines along the lips to create a really basic skull tooth look. Once I've applied those lines, I'm taking the white shimmer powder from Gorgeous Cosmetics again and just applying it in between those lines to create kind of like a shimmery teeth look. This just adds a little bit to the glamour skull effect.
I'm then just grabbing this black eyeshadow again and adding some shading around one side of my forehead. And then using my black eyeliner, I'm creating a cracked look just by applying a line and then a few lines coming off that line. Does that make sense? You can see what I'm doing here. This just creates a cracked skull look. Lastly, I'm just adding some more shimmer powder around my cheekbones to give this glamour skull a final shimmery glam effect. Okay guys, and there we have the completed simple glamour skull makeup look. If you enjoyed this one today, please do give this video a thumbs up. If you have any requests for a look you would like to see, please let me know in the comments down below. I am obsessed with skulls, so if you also like to create skull makeups, you'll definitely find a range of skull tutorials on my channel. And guys, don't forget to go and follow me on all my other social media platforms. All the links are in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys for the next tutorial. Bye.